so now basically we can display the uh, available VPN servers locations that is alongside with a country flag for which we will create a separate screen so in order to do that first we need a controller location controller which we will manage using the get extract management so for that purpose uh, right click right click on controller new dot file and we can give it name as vpn location controller underscore controller underscore vpn underscore location so this is our vpn location controller controller vpn location which will of course extends the getx controller initialize a list of VPN which is of type VPN info model class VPN list VPN servers list or you can say all the VPN servers which are available freely for free F references dot VPN list make sure to import vpn info which is our model class then final rx boolean is loading new locations false dot obvious that is when the locations are in a loading process when it is retrieving okay on the basis of this boolean type rx boolean type variable we will display basically a progress bar if it is in loading form if it is still retrieving with the help of this rx boolean variable uh, we will manage okay so anyways now retrieve VPN information so we will say is set this to true as we are going to retrieve the VPN information first we will make sure that our VPN server list is empty so we have to make sure that it is clear first and then we will get all the uh, VPN servers using our API which is which we implement just now API, API VPN get API VPN get dot retrieve all available free VPN servers we will call this method we will call this method from our API VPN get if I show you it is basically this method and the return type of this is a list which is basically a list contains all the VPN servers available okay all all available free VPN servers all those servers are inside this list so it will return that list as you see it is returning that list which contain the VPN servers available so that list we get when we call this method and once we get that list we will assign that list to our VPN servers list if you want to give it a proper name then you can do that just select this VPN server list right click on it refractor rename and the proper name will be VPN you can say free servers available list okay so you can see that it changed the name to 
VPN free servers available list. So that list which is the free servers which comes all the way from the API that list that list is basically now assigned to our this VPN free server available list and then once we get all those freely available VPN servers then we have to uh, set our this boolean type variable to false in order to stop the uh, loading animation of course which we will set later on on the user interface on the basis of this rx boolean type is loading new location variable so as we have implemented or you can say control the VPN location using the get extract management the next thing is basically to create that screen so right click on all screens new dot file and we will give it name as available VPN servers location underscore screen import the material dot create status widget we will give it name as available VPN servers location it is basically many VPN servers okay the countries from different countries 